Hello everybody, this is uh, C Baller and I'm showing you my uh, chicken coop setup. This is all part of my chicken coop setup here. As you can see my chickens are starting to come towards me. I free range them in this nice large field. I know it's kind of bad idea because there's a lot of hawks, you know. But, and that's not, that's not my trailer, it's my buddy that stays here. So that's my pole barn. Uh, so, these are my chickens, as you can see. These ones here will come right up to me. See, I got some grass. These ones, come here, buddy. One of these ones likes me. I don't know which one it is. It's one of these black and white ones. Probably this guy. Come here. Oh, yeah. Here he comes. Might peck my hand a little bit. Ah, see yep. See that? He pecked my hand. But he's a beautiful bird. He's right up close to me, as you can see. These chickens don't mind people. Uh, in this big cage here, I have some turkeys. There's two of them. I don't let them free range yet because they're, they're just not used to the environment yet. So they won't, I don't know if they'll come back or not. So I just leave them in here, but... They're nice turkeys, nice big ones. And I got the roost back there for them, put their water and food under this tarp so it doesn't get wet. And I got a little house over here, and they can go in there if they want. Yeah, that's for like with the hen, or not the hen, but the female turkey to lay. And then back this way, as you can see this turkey, or I mean this chicken, uh, he's got some problems on his back from the roosters. But we got chicken coop. This is all their nesting boxes. They usually lay a lot of eggs in here. I got light in here with the, the electrical boxes all hooked up. And their food is hanging and their water's just in the middle. But these guys are nice. They lay blue eggs. And I just took the eggs out, unfortunately. I should probably just kept those in for the video. But then we got this fake goat. But these are some bantams. Uh, they're Easter egg or Americana bantams. They're nice birds. Um, those ones just usually sit up on that roost over there. Same breed, but they can go up there. They can go up and up. And then they can not fly out of those holes, hopefully. And uh, we just planted this shrub here for them to pick at a little bit. And then we go around the back way here. We got my supply shed. And my supply shed, it does not have light, but I have all my stuff in here. I got my feed, my chicken wire, my tools, uh, bedding, everything really. And we just built this coop here, connects to this run, and we just have some little uh, Americana, or no, 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 no mini bantams in here just little guys I'll see if I can catch one here they're pretty birds this one I always pick up it usually doesn't mind being picked up but I'll get one that's fine with me so if you once you get their feet they're hey He doesn't mind it now. I only got five of those in here, but then, oops, I got a run going up here. So they can come up here and perch on this tree. And then just a couple of little nesting boxes up here for them. And the reason I don't put these in with the big ones is, uh, well, see, I got this. This one goes back and in because they like a lot of privacy. And uh, the reason I put this tarp on this one was for the in the winter the sun radiates the heat mostly. So that's why I put that on there. And now I'll show you my broilers. And my broilers are um, they're getting bigger. I'll show you my pheasants first. I got my pheasants in this. 
Let's see if my buddy can chase them down here. Yeah, there they are. I still have them under the heat lamp just for, cause it's getting, it's kind of cold in Minnesota right now, even though it should be warm. It's a little cold, but. Uh, my broilers are right down over here. Uh, I just opened up them to be able to go in this uh, corn crib. And I covered that with chicken wire. So they're in there right now. Ooh, yeah, that one just took a dookie on video for you. <laughs> and they do love their food. I'll go get... I had some food. I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I did with it. Oops. But, anyways. If I open this up, I do have 35 of them. So there should be a lot of them right there. And there is. And these guys are getting pretty darn big. Well, thank you for watching. And I will be uploading more about my chicken coop setup next weekend, probably. Alright, see you later.